none of us are exempt from ever experiencing a disaster. Angie and her family just went through a few days without electricity. As a part of the Red Cross, she knows the importance of being prepared. We even saw the buck stove with a battery backup. So uh, at least we have a warm area in our home to go to in the event that there is a power outage. She recommends stocking up on essentials, food, water, and safe ways to stay warm. Um, unfortunately, when cold weather happens, we do see tend to see an increase in home fires as people look for alternative ways to keep their homes warm. Between the holidays and the pandemic, many places that would serve as warming centers are closed. In the past, we were able to open a congregate shelter with cots and blankets, and we could put everyone in the same area. And right now, that's not safe. So the Red Cross, of course, is looking at alternative ways. Should emergency shelters open, they may be limited in capacity this year. That's why Angie recommends finding ways to stay safe at home. What a better way to come into the new year than to resolve to have your family safe and be prepared in the event that you need to um, take action in the event of a disaster.